The question says, a force acts on a particle of mass 4kg and changes its velocity from 3i plus 4g, uh, 3i plus 4j, this is meters per second, to 6i plus 8j meters per second. How much work is done on each? So in this question, we're going to find the, the, the amount of work done in moving or in changing the velocity of this particle of 4kg mass from this velocity to this velocity. Now, we know that work is force times distance in direction of that force. Since the force is acting on this particle of this mass and changing the velocity from this to this, one kind of work, or rather, the kinetic energy is the energy that is, uh, or that results uh, from a motion of an object. Let's say this is the mass, which is 4 kg, and then we have got this velocity that is changing from this to this. Now, the kinetic energy of that, the kinetic energy is equal to work. So we can say solutions. So work here is equal to kinetic energy. And we know that kinetic energy is equal to half m v squared, where we have m for kg. Then we have the vi, which is the v initial, is equal to 3i plus 4j meters per second, then vf, which is equal to 6i plus 8j meters per second. So B, or the resultant velocity, or the change in velocity will be, so B will be equal to Vf minus Vi. So here we have, so for this we're going to have 6i plus 8j minus 3i plus 4j. These are meters per second. So this one, we're going to have, we add the like terms. So we're going to have 6i minus 3i plus 8j minus 4j meters per second. From this, we are going to find that we're going to have 3 minus 6 minus 3, we're going to have 3i. Then 8 minus 4, we have 4 j. These are meters per second. So this is velocity. Now, this is velocity in terms of a vector, in terms of x and y components. So the magnitude of this, the magnitude of this is given by, so b, for the magnitude, we have, so this one we're going to have a square root of 3 squared plus 4 squared, which is going to give us, so this one, 3 squared is 9, 4 squared is 16, so 16 plus 9, we're going to have 25 there. And square root of 25, this is 5, so units, meters per second. So now, plugging in this value in this, we're going to have, this is half, times mass is 4, times uh, 5 squared. So this is 1, <clears throat> 2 into 2 is 1, 2 into 4 is 2. So we have 2 times, 5 times 5 is 25. So from this, what we're going to have is 2 times 25, we're going to have 50. And then the units for energy is 50, uh, the units, this is uh, joules. So 50 joules is the amount of work that must be done in moving the particle of mass um, 4 kg, or rather in changing the velocity of 4 kg mass from this to this. Thank you so much for watching the video.